Uh, yesterday, the 9th of Muharram, uh, was a very memorable day for me and it was a very, very heavy day. I woke up in the morning before uh, sunrise, about 40 minutes before sunrise, and I prayed the Fajr with my wife. And I was doing my uh, word uh, of Quran and others. All of a sudden, my daughter came to me and said that she had a meeting with someone at 7 o'clock, so I had to leave everything and forget about uh, making the word of Salatu Wassalamu Ala Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi I got ready and drove her to where she wanted to go, stayed with her for about nearly two hours. I came back and very, very uh, tired because I was fasting on that 9th of Muharram. I slept and I woke up nearly at 11 o'clock and I forgot also to make uh, the word of Salatu Wassalamu Ala Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Because I wanted to go to the bank to make the internet banking for one of our organizations. I was there delayed for nearly an hour plus. And uh, by the time I finished it was nearly 12 o'clock. I was trying to rush to go to the central uh, mosque to pray there. And I went to the car park to look for my car. And I was at least for 15 minutes going around and around using my remote and uh, uh, to can't find it in the uh, uh, level two under the ground, so minus two. And I went to one of the shops in this uh, level two underground. And she told me you might find it in level one if you forgot it. For the first time, it happened to me that I go to level one underground. And when I went there, I found it. Alhamdulillah. And not only that, I found that the, I left the window, the front window open. Anyway, I managed to, uh, I managed to drive the car. By the time I arrived, no, no, before I, before I drove the car, I was trying to put the car inside the machine fall down oh my god i couldn't be able to move because the, the door was so close to the wall i have to squeeze myself out and go and look at where's my card i found about 20 cards on the floor unfortunately my god my god my god i picked the first one was used second one was used the third one that was my card so it opened the gate for me and they run and so I rushed with the car to the mosque. The car park was full and I was told to come back for the second prayer after 15 minutes. I went around and around and around and I came back again to the mosque trying to get in. The young man told me there's no chance. The people are coming now. I have to come back in five minutes. But I found him letting another black Mercedes car inside. Alhamdulillah, I found, I parked on the pavement and uh, I came back to him in a little bit angry move. So why you let this man to come in and not me? He said, but he's coming for uh, the funeral. I did not trust him, but anyway, I went to the, uh, to the mosque to listen. And what makes it worse is uh, Khatib was talking about Ashura, or the 10th of Muharram. He did not focus on the message of say Allah the saving Moses, peace be upon him, but he more focused on the message of the killing of Hazrat Hussein alayhi salam by Yazid and changed it into, I was just listening to the speech and the, oh, I couldn't be able to believe it. The great story of uh, the stick and the sea and the children of Israelite and Moses meeting Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in Sinai, getting the Ten Commandments. And this man, instead of talking about all these things which make us to be very proud of the mission of Musa Salam, he was talking about uh, Yazid and uh, al Hussein alayhi salam. Anyway, the moral of the story today, because, because I forgot to make my word of salatu wa salamu alayka, Sayyidi Rasulullah, 
And this was actually uh, what happened to me. First of all, I uh, couldn't be able to find my car in the car park. Then I couldn't be able to put my card in the machine properly. Then I missed the first prayer. Then I argued with the young man in the mosque. Then Allah, so then I listened to this khutbah. But, and, but the good thing I have done in this day is I managed to give my apology to the young man when I, le- when I actually finished my prayer. Uh, don't forget that the Salat was salamu alayka sallam uh, is nur in your heart, is light in your heart, in your soul, in your life, in your family and others. Don't stop saying it. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.